Graves. Huxon Launch is connecting Space Shuttle Discovery to the International Space Station of Let Go, and springs in that mechanism are pushing the shuttle away from the station, marking the end of the docked portion of the STS-131 mission at 7.52 a.m. Central Time, 12 days, 2 hours, and 31 minutes into Discovery's mission. Discovery departing. Bell tolling to mark Discovery's departure. Shuttle and station are 217 miles above New Guinea, and the shuttle spent a total of 10 days, 5 hours, and 8 minutes docked to the space station. And this again is sequential still video being sent down through the shuttle's S band antenna, as a video downlink isn't currently available. Discovery is leaving behind 7.6 tons of cargo and equipment brought in the, up in the shuttle's mid deck and cargo bay including four new science racks that will improve the station's Earth observation capabilities and help astronauts fight muscle astrophy, and also a new ammonia tank assembly that will help keep the station's systems cool. It's taking home with it another 3.3 tons of used equipment and scientific samples, clearing out some space on the station, which has been filling up steadily over the past several missions. Discovery is scheduled to return to the station one more time for the STS-133 mission, the final shuttle mission actually, currently scheduled for September. Thanks, you and your crew were excellent guests. We loved having you here. You helped us leave the station in a better place than when you got here. Our mission, come back soon. Thanks, TJ. We enjoy every minute of it. Thanks for the great hospitality. We'll talk to you soon. Safe landings. Flight Engineer T.J. Creamer giving uh, one more goodbye on behalf of the station's crew to Space Shuttle Discovery, in particular Commander Alan Poindexter talking there. And as he mentioned, uh, not too much longer before Discovery will be back, it'll be bringing the Leonardo module again that's currently inside the shuttle's cargo bay, coming back with it, uh, but by then it will have been converted from its moving band form of a multipurpose logistics module into a permanent multipurpose module and we'll be staying at the station after that mission to provide the station crew with some storage space. <laughs>